Germany's Jewish community is being urged to continue to circumcise baby boys in spite of a recent ruling by a Cologne court that the practice amounts to bodily harm and should only be performed on males old enough to give consent. The president of the Conference of European Rabbis, Rabbi Pinchas Goldschmidt, has been in Berlin defending the ritual. I don't think that today there is a quasi-ban of circumcision in Germany, but it is an attack on circumcision, a big attack on circumcision. Goldschmidt says the court's decision could just be the tip of the iceberg. I am here because I think that this is not only a problem for Germany, but a problem for Europe. Germany is an integral part, one of the most important parts of Europe. So we want to solve this problem here first. The rabbi's words come following an emergency meeting earlier this week of 40 of Berlin's rabbis who gathered to discuss the ramifications of the ruling against circumcision. Many fear it could lead to members of the Jewish community being prosecuted if they perform the ritual on their sons. Germany's Muslims have also voiced concern over the Cologne court's verdict, though say that as circumcision is not obligatory for them, they are less affected than Jews. Germany's foreign minister has been quick to offer assurances that the right to the free exercise of religion is protected by the country's constitution. Jews believe circumcision is an integral part of their faith and will be hoping to continue the practice within the bounds of the law.